Hi there. Uh, further to a few comments and questions I've been getting on my uh, map and compass uh, videos. And there seems to be a few of you out there that find the subject of magnetic variation a bit confusing. Uh, but actually it's not. It's pretty simple. It's pretty straightforward. So I just thought I'd put this video together to, to, to explain it in detail. Uh, basically, in map and compass work, there's two bearings you can take. You can take a magnetic bearing, in which you just use the compass itself, or you can take a grid bearing, in which you use the map and the compass together. So that's a magnetic bearing and a grid bearing. And if you remember, all compass needles point to magnetic north. A magnetic north and grid north are not the same. There's a slight difference, and that difference is called the magnetic variation. And if you look on the legend of your map, it'll tell you what that magnetic variation is. It differs from where you are in, in the world. So, if you've taken a magnetic bearing, and you want to convert it to a grid bearing, then you subtract the variation. And if you've taken a grid bearing, and you want to convert that to a magnetic bearing, then you add the variation. And that's it. Pretty straightforward. Uh, but if you've got a few questions, uh, any questions at all, just uh, leave us a message.